Hi everyone, my name is Nicole R. Vincent. I'm here today to tell you about my heart opening energy session. In this session, we are focused on opening your heart. When our hearts are open, we're able to truly connect with ourselves, with others, and with God. And this is so important, and so many people struggle because their heart is blocked in some way or, or form energetically. Now, as we do this, we're able to feel lighter. We're able to have better connections. We're able to feel more like ourselves. We're able to feel freer and just feel better in general as we clear this heart space, as we open the heart. Now, in this remote session, I check for different things. First, I start off the session by checking for four different areas and how open your heart is in those areas. The first area is how open is your heart to goodness, light, and truth? The next area I check is how open is your heart to giving love to yourself? Next is how open is your heart to giving love to others? And last but not least is how open is your heart to receiving love from God? I check these and give it a percentage rating so that we can see after all of the releases, I check them again to see what progress has been made. The first area I check and release from is the heart wall. The heart wall is an energetic device around the heart that the subconscious creates and is typically made up of different trapped emotions. In this section on your release, you will see a specific emotion and then an age, a number by that emotion. And that's an approximate age, give or take in a year in either direction. So these emotions are released from the heart wall. The next area that I check is for adversarial attacks. And adversarial attacks are attacks from outside of ourselves. Some people might call this opposition, darkness, negativity, the devil, Satan, the enemy. I just use the word adversary to help encapsulate everything. And these are attacks that are attacking our heart and causing problems. These are typically connected to a different emotion or a belief and that will be noted in your notes as those are released. The next area that I check is for a no will energy or you might say no desire energy. Something, an example of a no will energy is I have no will to do the dishes. <laughs> Um, but you can have a no will energy. I have no will to change, or I have no will to progress, or I have no will to heal. These various energies can create blocks that prevent us from progressing and becoming our best self. The next area that I check is for negative programming. Just like a computer has programs to run on and perform various functions, so do we. And sometimes that programming can get negative. So I look for and identify various negative emotions uh, sorry, negative programming that can be connected to negative emotions or negative beliefs and release those as well. Next, I look for absorbed emotions and release those. Absorbed emotions are when we're kind of soaking up the emotions or negative energy of, of those around us. And very common, most people tend to absorb people's emotions. So I easily release those and allow you to have less interference in your life. The next thing that I release to limit interference in your life are negative and dark cords. Now, cords are energetic connections that we have with other people. We can have positive cords, and I don't touch those positive cords. Those are just, they, those stay in place. But I look for negative and dark uh, connections or cords and release those. Because as we have negative connections with other people, places, things, ideas, etc., we have a lot of interference in our energetic space, in our heart space. And so I'm able to release those as part of the session. The last thing that I'm going to do for you in your session is test to see what is your best essential oil or essential oil blend to use to help you in your process of opening your heart. Using essential oils were key in my healing journey to help open my heart and are a vital tool and powerful tool to help you in this process. If you need help getting those essential oils, let me know or talk to your favorite oil person. The last thing as part of the session is a guided audio meditation, opening and filling the heart with light and goodness and helping you be open to sharing your light with others. This quick meditation will help you grow and help you nurture your heart space and help fill with light and goodness. After we've done all the releases, I check those top four, those four areas again, goodness, love of self, love of others, and love from God to see how you've improved in each of those areas. Now, most of the time, we're not going to open your heart in one session. 
sometimes it takes a few sessions. So be ready for a few, uh, uh, it's a process and be ready for a few sessions. But as you progress, as you heal and heal that heart energetically, you're going to feel like your best self. And so I'm very excited to offer this to you today. And I hope you take advantage of it. The way that you book a session with me is to go to my website, Nicole R, don't forget the R, vincent.com slash services and request a heart opening session with me today. Thanks guys. We'll see you soon.